everyone, this is Maggie from Armature and I'm recording a series of videos to show you how easy it is to use our quality management platform, Armature Fabric. One of the things that sets Fabric apart is how configurable it is. You really can build whatever workflows and forms you need with no coding required. In my last video, I showed you how to create and change processes and today I'm going to focus on instrument building. In our system, an instrument is any information gathering tool, such as an audit checklist or a self-assessment, that you create and send to your suppliers, other departments in your organization, or the folks on the shop floor. They fill it out online and all of that data is captured, tracked, and visible within our system. So you can use it to inform your quality decisions. In this brief demo, I'll show you an instrument that I built in the system, and then I'll make some changes to it in real time, so you can see how easy it is to configure your checklists and forms with no coding, extra costs, or added hassle involved. So let's get started. We're on the main dashboard now, and there are two ways to get to instruments. You can click in here, or you can go over to the side navigation and find your instruments tab and click in through there. So let's click in. Here you'll see the instruments dashboard. Like all of our other dashboards, on the left is a personalized view and on the right is a global view. So now I'm going to pull up an instrument that I built. It's a generic 8D and we're just going to search for it. Okay, here it is. And so I built this in the system. It took about 45 minutes for me to plug in all of the disciplines and the content I wanted to include. This instrument is four pages long. And within each of these pages are several questions that when deployed will give the person who's been asked to fill this out the ability to do so. Everything that's filled out in the system gets saved through a save button and it will get tied back to the person and the organization or department that person is with. Okay, so there are a couple of things to note here. We have the ability to create narrative questions, choice questions, and let's see if we scroll down, you'll see an example of table questions. You can add as many rows as you'd like. And within this instrument, I've also added the ability to track an issue. So if we wanted to, we could put an issue in here, we could call it whatever we'd like, and we could save it and, and it would go back into the system where it would start to be tracked and logged as an issue that needs to be addressed. So the other thing I'm going to show you quickly is on the last page. Again, you've got four pages here. This instrument is inspired by the famous eight disciplines model for problem solving. So let's scroll down. I just want to show you something. One thing we do really well in the system is we give you the ability to upload evidence along the way, documents or photos, and they'll live with the instrument for the duration of its time in the system. Every time this instrument is pulled up, Anything that's been uploaded here would also be pulled up. Okay, so I'm going to click out of here and to end this segment, I'm going to take you to setup and I want to show you what our instrument builder looks like. Again, this is the instrument that I just showed you in the system. Now you're seeing it in an instrument building view. Let's decide that we're going to add something to this question. So we've got team goals, team objectives. How about we add a third item here? Okay, so I'm just going to click in here. And let's add, just for demonstration's sake, we'll add a section here called team qualifications. Okay, so we're going to click in. Okay, and team qualifications. Okay, we're applying that. We're going to add this. It's going to be the element. We're going to make it narrative. We're going to apply it. And you'll notice the difference here in formatting. We can fix that. There are cell options here. Vertically align at the top. And now we have the exact same look here. You can also add other questions. You can make a standard question and just say, let's see, we'll create a simple question. Date of first meeting. 
And then we'll go to date and time. Call this date and that's it. So now let's save this and we can preview it if we want to. So now when you deploy this again in the system, you'll see that it has the team qualifications and third question here about the date of the first meeting. So hopefully this helps you see what Armature Fabric can do from an instrument building standpoint. You can create an instrument in our system that matches your current manual processes or even bring a new vision to life in a matter of clicks. And then you can use that instrument to gather evidence and information, generate insights and reports, and drive organizational excellence. It's really easy to do by design. Thank you so much for watching.